we should we should do that. Do you think do you think they can hear us? No, of course they can. <laughs> I love you too. I'm Simon Max Hill. I'm a casting director here in Portland, Oregon. Uh, I'm best known for casting all eight seasons of Portlandia. I've also done a number of other really great uh, movies, some of which even won awards. What was it that made you say, huh, I could do the casting thing? Uh, it's not as cool of a story as it sounds like. Uh, I was doing locations because I like taking pictures and I... Uh, was I don't think very good at it and I definitely didn't enjoy it so I quit I just called all the producers I worked for and I was like I don't want to do locations anymore I'm I'm sorry to let you down I just can't like it's f***ing me up uh, but I, if you have anything else let me know and thankfully uh, I think it was like David Cress and uh, Brad Goldthwait probably also Kevin Sullivan and uh, Ed Gustamante uh, over at Food Chain, we're like, sure, cast this, like, be a casting assistant, and then they were like, okay, you can be our in-house casting guy, and they kind of taught me the way they did it, and I used their equipment, and then I, like, improved on their processes and started buying my own equipment, and then... You don't mind if I lay on the floor during this, do you? Are you wearing underwear? Uh, I am wearing underwear. Okay, let's harvest your trauma, then. Actually, just do it facing the wall. It's much better. I don't like your face. Should I do one more take, or...? You can go. Okay. And I'll see you later. All right. Thanks. Uh, so that was my first job. I think like one of the reasons I, I became a member is just a sense that like the OMPA like helps with with lobbying. Like I mentioned the incentive like previously OMPA was like involved in in helping continue and expand that incentive program, which is like directly results in more TV and film happening here in town. You need someone to advocate for you, and you need like a sense that other people exist as professionals in your industry. It's good to have a dues-paying group um, with resources that they can call on. We're like a medium-sized city. We have really no right to have as many like great actors and talent agents and uh, experienced film people as we do. I came up with a lot of people here in town who really believed in like if you have equipment and it's sitting idle and somebody is doing a project that's a labor of love, give them the equipment, give them the space, uh, allow them to train on your gear and grow because like the community grows that way.